Hi, I'm Cindy from BeDanceWear.com and in this video I'm going to show you a lot of different things you can do with our convertible sports bra. So first of all, the first one would be just keeping it sports bra front. Um, the other is it comes with a string that you can cinch up. And you just simply grab it and then tie this in a bow. So you can keep it with the bow. You could just knot it and cut it off. It won't fray. You'll wanna make sure when you do this that you twist in any of the lining so the lining is not visible to anyone and then there's this the front like that you could also take this and hide this inside now if you want to do that I suggest that you cut the bow off and then just tuck it in now you can take these straps and keep them straight you can take them both to one side you can crisscross them it doesn't have to be crisscrossed here you could crisscross that tighter and either knot it, sew it, or put a brooch right there. Um, that would bring it down a little from the neck, uh, which gives you just a little bit more room. Some girls don't like things real close to their neck. You could take this and just twist it and bring it up. You could also take this strap straight back and take this one over to match up, leaving a keyhole. Now remember, all of this stuff could be done with or without this tie front. But when you do it, you'll wanna make sure this tucks in, make sure everything's taunt. I suggest if you want it to stay in place in the same spot every time you take it on or off, that you put a knot in it or just take a little simple stitch. So what you'll wanna think about after that is the way it comes over the back. Does, do you have both straps on one side or do you have it like this? Now, I've put in the back, these ties must go through this looper or this one because otherwise there's nothing holding the front together and keeping it on. This area will need to be really tight. So when you do it, you'll wanna make sure everything's taunt up front. If you need to tack it into place because you feel more comfortable like that, feel free to do that. If you don't like the strings hanging on, you can knot it up and either tuck it under or tuck it and then tack it under. You could even sew it off. If you sew it off, um, then it's permanently there and then you don't have to worry about that quick change in the costume. I definitely suggest you leave it partway strapped up if you're tying a bow. Don't try and redo it each time. I find that if I put a safety pin just in the end, it makes it th feed through nice and fast. So you could use this tie instead of using it in the front or cut it in half. Use half in the back instead of the white elastic I have here. Um, so as far as the back, remember it can go straight down and tie in a bow. It can go to one side or the other. It could crisscross, it could crisscross, and twist straight down and you can have this up towards the neck and then come across or you could keep that low and come back up the reverse you could even take that to one side there you could pull it all the way down now if you're coming both from the same side same idea twist and separate or keep them separated either one either one works you could have it knot down here and then separate so it keeps that spot together right there if it's like a halter and you want to keep a clean open back you could just knot that off and cut it off or sew it off either one doesn't matter just make sure that's secure so it doesn't open up during a competition uh, this one you could also take this and knot this here and come straight down. You could knot it further from the front so it opens up like that or then crisscrosses here. Think about if you're gonna rhinestone where you have to go and if you're wearing it for every day, get creative, have fun with it. You could also have it go through these bottom pieces and then when it, instead of tying here, tie it in a knot and loop this back through. Now let me show you what that looks like. 
So that would come back like this. And you could either knot it into place and tuck that down. You could bring it here or have it pinched off and bring it there making a really unique front to your top. Just remember when you're doing this, put it on, practice with it, play with it, see what looks best for your body and just have fun.